Shame, why don't you go get a hobby mate, you don't need no internet to play the piano. <coughs> Did the electricity just go, what's going on? Shame you clown, you just jinxed it for everyone. But luckily for you lot, I downloaded a video on my phone, don't need no internet or electricity. Come, come, you don't want to miss this video, we're going crazy. What's going on? Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Where were we? This is So Sad. The last song was So Sad. J. Charles' fifth album called... Yep, so today, track number five. Let's get straight into it, mate. I've heard this one. This is the one I heard. So this song's called Checkmate. So let's listen to that again. Let's go. <laughs> I heard this one, I remember it again. I like this song, very flowy. And yeah, check out the video if you haven't, it's up there. So yeah, check it out. too crazy now that song was crazy you already seen my reaction i'm gonna just say again production 10 out of 10 the flows dun 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 crazy bouncy you saw me bouncing vocals he sounded like a gangster rapper in this one so it wasn't a singing song it was more of a rap song but i like rap songs very nice and yeah this wasn't too sad but it was very smooth reading the lyrics it's about game plan controlling the game being attacking defensive 
a good little song. So yeah, I'm gonna give that one. The first time I heard it, it was all right. The second time I heard it, I liked it much more. I'm gonna give that one nine. Actually, do you know what? The thing is, I wanna give it nine point something, but at the same time, I like number three more. So I'm gonna give this one nine point one. So far, this album's crazy. So yeah, we have the next song. We have Step Aside. That's crazy. Let's go. Sorry about that, I just, I just read the lyrics. This is just so, I'm gonna read the lyrics to you, watch this. I can't forgive myself, so please take it that I am not here anymore. Do you know what, I'm not even gonna read the rest because it's too sad. This is getting too sad for me, man. I like this song, let's keep going. Can I just say, that was the saddest song I heard in about five minutes. That was so crazy. This song, I don't know what to say, man. Because that... You saw my face. I was about to cry. This is so sad. I was reading the lyrics. I was getting more sad. And yeah, what can I say? I don't know. Unfortunately, that's all we have time for today. But that song... 
I don't want to. I don't want to end this episode. I feel like I haven't said enough. Can I just say the structure of that song? Very nice build up. Their vocal emotion he was building it up. Was getting to the top, and then at the last bit, you heard him put his top ten vocals out there. It's crazy. And yeah, man, the production was nice and perfectly orchestrated. To, do you know what it is? The production, yeah. I feel like they make it specifically to make you feel specific ways. So the last song, or the grandma song, I felt like happy. Then I, then slowly, slowly, I was getting more sad. But this one, I heard it straight away and I was feeling sad from the beginning. I feel like the producer's done a good job on that one. I'm guessing Jay Chow produced that one. Very nice. And yeah, man. Very smooth track. As I've written down on the board. His vocals, flows, the production. This is so sad. And the smoothness. What can I say? On the board, I'm going to have to give that one. Nice and sad. That's even sadder than the other one. This album's going crazy so far. It's like this. Gone off the scales, mate. But you know what? Unfortunately, that's all we have time for today. But you know I got videos dropping every day. So be sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video, mate.